Yeah, so uh, he said, I got a problem because my student visa won't let me leave, won't let me go back to Colombia to marry you or you back. So when Sean deal, I had to stay, finish, and then I can leave. She's like, well, that's all right. I'll go to Philadelphia and we'll get married there. And as soon as her mom found out about that, she said, Missy, in 1963, women at your age do not travel by themselves to go off to be with men. And she said, well, wait a minute, I'm going to get married. This doesn't matter. It does not matter. You have to stay here. So, uh, so the solution to the problem was this. My dad signed a marriage license in the United States, mailed it back to Columbia, and his little brother stood in for him and said his vows to my mom. <laughs> I know, I know. So, <laughs> that's not the wedding that my mom had envisioned, you know, and so they were getting married in the largest cathedral in downtown Medellin, in Colombia. So she's like, all right, you know, if that's the way they're gonna treat me. So she showed up to this wedding wearing a knee-length black cocktail dress. <laughs> to protest the injustice. So I told my friend Sheen Cooley, we write some songs together, and he said, man, I'm not gonna write that song, I'm gonna do it for you. So we went out to my front porch the next day and we came up with this. This is called Married in a Black Dress, and this is for my mom and dad. <laughs>
Thank you.